Hey guys, it's Anne with CNSave.com and welcome to day one of Vlogist. Vlogging every day in August, although I always say videos every day in August because while I will be doing a lot of vlogs, um, I will also be doing a lot of just standalone topic videos. Well, maybe not a lot, but some. Uh, such as this one, the back to school videos will be standalone videos because I know some of you guys are specifically watching for uh, this year's shopping. So it is week five of the back to school shopping challenge. Uh, today I'm going to Walgreens, Staples, and Target. Um, also be sure to check the back to school section on my blog. I will link it below for all of the deals. There's tons of stuff at uh, Office Max and Office Depot again this week, Penny Deals. Walgreens has a ton of stuff. Target has a ton of stuff. There's some things at Staples. I don't have the Office Max, Office Depot stores here, which I'm bummed about. But like I said, I am going to Walgreens, uh, Staples, and Target this week. So uh, let's see what deals I can find today. So like I said, there are a ton of deals at Walgreens, both just on sale and with in-ad coupons. Uh, the one I am specifically going in are these 49 cent pens. And to be honest, some hair color. I need some hair color. So pens and hair color. Let's see um, if they have what I'm looking for. Okay, and just out of Walgreens, got my 49 cent pens. Signage was not up yet, um, so that's why important. That's why it is important to uh, have the ad and check it. Um, they have blue and they have black, and there doesn't seem to be a limit uh, to as how many you can buy. It says they're regularly a dollar ninety nine, so forty nine cents for those. And just a quick peek. Yes, I got my hair color. Buy one, get one half off. And full disclosure, I bought two Heath candy bars down there because Hershey candy bars are on sale for 69 cents. So that's everything at Walgreens. Now I am headed to Staples. Here at Staples and this week you can get penny paper again with a printable coupon. So it's um, use the coupon, you pay out of pocket for the paper and then it will print an easy rebate with your receipt that you can submit to get your money back minus a penny. So that makes the paper only a penny. Then there are four weekly school steals. We have 25 cent erasers and 25 cent pencil sharpeners, 50 cent Bic pens and 50 cent paper mate pencils. We shall see if I can find these. If you've been following me along, you know I have a little bit of trouble here at Staples. The signage isn't always out and the items aren't always available. I did actually complain to them on Facebook. I'm like, the store in my area is a mess. Please get them straightened out. Ah, and I also got a coupon by mail. $10 off an in-store purchase of $10 or more regularly priced items. This is the key. I've gotten these before and then it's hard to find anything that's actually not on sale or some kind of special. So uh, I'm going to look around and see if I can find anything to use this on. But uh, at least I know I'll be able to get the paper. The other items we shall see. So wish me luck. Well, the signage isn't out except for the erasers, but I did manage to find the items that are on sale. And look at all the clearance in the back, including these ice scrapers for 50 cents. I'm getting one. So just got a staples. I used my $10 um, gift card to go towards this uh, day timer. It's a mom planner, <laughs> but it's a 12 month planner and it starts now, which is actually good. Um, I'm always struggling to find a planner I like because, now I can't get this one open, um, I like to have some pockets and I like to have a little envelope and things, you know, these little things in here, the spiral bound, change the pages, so yeah, I think I will hopefully like this one, maybe, we'll see, I'm sure I'll find some reason not to use it, there's the pen thing, which I always like too, but hopefully I can get in the habit of using a planner because I have various calendars and lists ugh, all over the place but um, I kind of liked this I like the pink it does have a little pattern on it. I don't really care about that um, but it was about 10 bucks less than the other more traditional day timers and I actually like the look of this one um, better and you got to use that $10 gift card towards the purchase of it I am now at Target they are having a 99 cent back to school load up stock up whatever sale this week um some of these deals are just okay you know they're the kind of things that you could get 
um, every week at Walgreens or the office supply store or Walmart for about the same price. But if Target is your store and you just want to do a one-stop shop, these are some good deals. I'm specifically looking for the six count of glue sticks and Mead five star products are on sale. And then there were these Mead coupons in the Sunday paper. This one is a dollar off any two five star products. And I'm gonna be looking for folders, which should be a dollar. So if they're a dollar, I'll be able to get two for 50 cents each. So we'll see what I can find in Target. All right, guys, I am now home from Walgreens, Staples, and Target. Here's everything I got today. I'm not including the planner I bought in this haul, um, just because that was something extra and special, full price, and I had the other coupon. Um, not including that in the back to school shopping challenge. So uh, for the deals that you guys can also score this week at the stores, that's what I'm gonna be showing you. Everything you see here with tax and after easy rebate and coupons, I spent $4.27 on everything you see here. So first at Staples, got the Hammer Mill copy paper with that printable coupon. It is only a penny after easy rebate. Also at Staples, got the 25 cent pencil sharpener and the 25 cent cap erasers. And then these Papermate pencils and Bic pens were each 50 cents. At Walgreens, got the 49 cent pens. And at Target, I got the Mead folders. They're on sale two for $2, so a dollar each. I used the dollar off any two Mead five-star product coupon that is in the Sunday paper and paid 50 cents each for these. And then the five packs of Elmer glue sticks are on sale this week for 99 cents. And my store had these bonus packs and I just used the uh, price scanning machine to double check. And yes, these rang up for 99 cents. So Again, with tax and after easy rebate, $4.27 for everything you see here. And now I'm gonna lay out everything that I've gotten over the past five weeks and show you my to-date haul. All right, guys, here's everything I've gotten for the past five weeks. Now I am making an adjustment. Remember these bounty towels I got on clearance at Staples? I'm taking these out of my haul total. Uh, these were on clearance for a dollar each, so I'm removing those and just doing the supplies. Um, so when I take those out, that brings my five week total with tax to $42.76. So let's see, we're up to six reams of paper, ruler, pencil box, three glues, lots of glue sticks, highlighters, Sharpies. We've got markers and colored pencils and crayons and scissors and pens, 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 pencils, folders, notebooks. Pencil sharpeners, erasers, more pens. Pretty darn good for only $42.76. So if you guys are liking these back to school shopping challenge videos, be sure to give this one a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you aren't already for more videos like this. Again, the back to school section on my blog will be linked below. Below, There you can find all of this week's deals as well as the full write-up uh, for my haul for this week, so go and check that out. And I will see you guys next week for week number six, although I will, well, technically I'll see you tomorrow because it's Vlogist and I'm doing videos every day in August. So be sure to subscribe for Vlogist. Till the next time guys, thanks for watching, bye.